What's up golfers? Welcome back to New Nine Golf. We had to pull an emergency press conference. So I apologize about shooting on the iPhone. We don't have our normal studio set up, but I had to tell you guys the news about the Jordan 4 release. Nike has officially announced that on March 4th at 10 a.m. Eastern, that's when the Jordan 4s are going to release. There's been a lot of confusion, and this is now obviously our third video in talking about the 4 release, but this is official from Nike. I had a source that was giving me the dates that just so happened to be the UK dates, so we weren't totally wrong, but for North America, uh, Canada, and the US, we didn't get a chance to get our shoes. So Nike has released again at March 4th at 10 a.m. Eastern. That is when the Jordan 4s are going to release. So I apologize again about the false alarms. I'm sure a bunch of you were just like me refreshing the computer, but it wasn't a joke. I was just trying to help you guys get uh, the 4s, obviously. So hopefully you get them on March 4th. And again, I apologize. But hey, I appreciate all of you. You know, I was in a couple meetings today and when I got out, my phone had just blown up from all of you guys messaging me be like, hey, the 4s, I think they're going to drop on uh, March and March and March. So I really appreciate all of you guys giving me the heads up. I wanted to again let the people who didn't know about the official release but now if you want the Jordan 4s in the golf shoe you can get them on March 4th so that's it for our press conference however I did have some cool new golf shoes come in that I wanted to show you guys starting with the Tiger Woods 14s these are one of the sickest shoes that I've seen uh Ever. And I had uh, one pair a long time ago and they got beat up and I couldn't find them again. So I found obviously a, they were, you know, they're sold to me as secondhand that someone has used them, but they seem to be in pretty good overall shape. What I'm considering doing is uh, if you haven't seen, there's uh, some companies that customize shoes. Uh, I know a lot of like NFL players, MLB, some guys obviously in golf shoes too. They're getting fully customizable golf shoes. I'm considering sending these to someone to customize them. The colors are a little outdated, although, you know, you can't really go wrong with uh, black, red, and white. And they have uh, the infamous Tiger Soul. So a lot of the uh, Jordan trainers went off of this sole. So I love the sole already. They seem to be in really good shape. And again, I think I'm going to send them for uh, fully customization. So I can't wait to show you guys these uh, when they're all done. It'll be a process, but stay tuned for that video. And a second pair of shoes that I picked up recently are the Jordan Flight Golf Shoes. So this is more of a mesh shoe. I'll call it a summer shoe. These ones are a little bit more worn than I was hoping for, but I'm going to do a full overhaul, give them a really thorough clean, and hopefully I can bring them uh, back to life. Obviously, I can't do much with a customized, so I think I'm just going to keep them the colorway that they are. Although they came with this really weird yellow, uh, let's see if you can see it there, this yellow tip of the toe that it was definitely meant to be that color, and I think it's a freaking weird color. I don't know if I can maybe get someone to airbrush that a different color, but I think visually that's probably the only flaw in this shoe. Um, I wouldn't want to be walking in any water in these. If it's a it's a full mesh suit shoe, a full mesh shoe, so it'll be uh, perfect for those hot days where you're walking around. Your feet get obviously really sweaty. I'm definitely going to be staying away from every puddle because this is a mesh shoe, so it's not going to be worth me getting my entire foot wet. Not in as good of a shape. This, I think, is a really good find. You can't find many of them out there, especially in new condition, and I wasn't willing to pay like 700 bucks for a pair. I think I got these for maybe $100 total, like shipped to my house. So I'm hoping I can do a, a good revamping, and I'm looking forward to maybe changing that toe color because that is the only part that I don't love about this shoe. Um, anyway, that's the news that I had for you guys. Again, but the Jordan 4 is releasing on March 4th at 10 a.m. Eastern. So set your alarms, and hopefully you can get a pair. They look freaking wicked. Um, a lot of people have been asking me about size. I don't have a pair yet. They do look wide wider like the uh the five or the yeah the fives so i'm thinking maybe if you're say a 10 for example maybe a nine and a half will fit just because they're a little bit wider so i know a lot of people that have a narrow foot fit into nikes personally i can't even fit into like a generic uh nike golf shoe anymore just because they're too narrow so it's been kind of a bummer that some cool shoes like the air max release or the air max 90s these shoes have come out and i get them and they're too tight like i have to return them right away so big bummer um, i'm hoping to get a pair of the fours so hopefully the size fits and thank you to all of you who reached out to me who who told me the release. This isn't obviously my full-time job, not yet anyway. So still had to pay the bills, but I'm so glad all of you guys gave me those notifications uh, just to inform me, to inform the people who don't know when the release is happening. So thanks again for supporting the channel. Hit subscribe if you haven't already. And thank you to all of our new subscribers. We're slowly growing and we see that growth. So thank you so much to all of you because this channel is impossible without you golfers. Hit them straight and we'll check in with you next time.